Hi, I'm Vivek, welcome to, Scientific, Portuguese Man of War, Vesalia Physalis, also known as the Man of War, Blue Bottle, or Floating Terror. This species has been found in the Atlantic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Indian Ocean, the Caribbean, and the Sargasso Sea. It floats on or near the surface of the water. Subscribe and stay with Dr. Vivek Scientific for more amazing scientific updates. The Portuguese Man of War, Vesalia Physalis, is absolutely alien-looking. With its bulbous top, dangling tentacles, and iridescent coloring, this unusual invertebrate will make anyone do a double take. Number 1. It looks like a jellyfish, but it's not a jellyfish. Portuguese men o wars may resemble jellyfish because of their bell and tentacles, but they are actually completely different. Man o wars are siphonophores, which are a type of hydrozoan comprised of many animals living together in a colony. Although both jellyfish and the man o war are part of the phylum Cnidaria, true jellyfish are in the class Cyphozoa, while man o wars are in class Hydrozoa. Number TWO, they rely on teamwork. Each Portuguese man o war is comprised of genetically identical individuals called zooids. Just like a coral head looks like one animal, but is made up of many polyps, a Portuguese man o war looks like one organism, but is made of many zooids. Zooids can perform different tasks depending on the needs of the organism. Parts of the animals include the nematophore, which is filled with gas and floats on the ocean surface, the gonozoids and gastrozoids, which are used for reproduction and digestion, and the dactylozoids, which are used for hunting and capturing prey. Number 3. Their tentacles can be very, very long. Portuguese man o war tentacles can stretch 165 feet below the surface, that is almost as long as the leaning tower of Pisa is tall. Not all man of wars have such impressive appendages though, the average tentacle length is about 30 feet. Number 4, they get their name from historical ships. The Portuguese men o wars inflated nematophore resembles the sail of 18th century Portuguese warship, which is where it got its unique name. The nematophore is typically a distinctive blue or purple color and can float half a foot above the ocean surface. Number 5, getting stung by a Portuguese man o war is not a good time. Portuguese men o wars have an emetocysts, or stinging cells, in their tentacles, which they use to stun and capture their prey. Unfortunately, they can also sting humans, even if the animal is dead or the tentacles are no longer attached. The venom is very painful to humans, and can result in skin welts or even an allergy-like response. If you see a Portuguese man o war, admire from afar and do not touch. If you are stung, pay close attention to your symptoms and seek medical attention if needed. Thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment.